Hi, I'm Bob Nanamacher. Uh, I'm a full-time artist in Gurney, Illinois. For, for 30 years, I worked in the book publishing business, uh, textbooks specifically. And uh, I used to do a lot of uh, illustrations for them. Um, I'd actually, before Photoshop, do a lot of art fixes for the publisher. Uh, before, like if there was a tight deadline, a piece was going out to uh, the, the printer, uh, sometimes uh, something had to be fixed and I would uh, work on these, you know, pieces of art that, uh, you know, were thousands of dollars and I was like uh, making fixes on them at the last minute before they get shipped out. My style of uh, my abstract paintings I, I call it my both sides paintings because I paint on both sides of, a, of the canvas, of a raw canvas. And then I use two different techniques and then I cut the canvas apart and flip over roughly every other piece so the two techniques play off each other. As far as my choice of colors, I like to not just use one color for the yellow. I use four or five, maybe even six different colors to make the yellow. And I do that for each color on the canvas. So there's a lot of uh, different paints going on, even though the red looks like a red, but if you look at it closely, there's like six colors in that red. Well, I was in college actually, and I was doing uh, a painting where I was working on untreated canvas, and I realized I didn't have anything underneath my canvas, and it started to seep through. And I went to get you know something to put under there, and I looked at it, and I liked what I saw on the other side. And so I th thought, well, I gotta try to incorporate both sides of the canvas, and that's when I cut it apart and, you know, start uh, putting uh, each side next to each other. Before I was doing the abstracts, I, I did several years of doing Native American portraits, and uh, those will be up at the show as well. I just needed a break from those and started doing the the abstracts, and now I'm actually starting to incorporate figurative work in with using this style of uh, that I use in my abstracts. Uh, yeah, the Native American culture has always been uh, an interest of mine, especially growing up here in New Ulm, uh, which has a you know a rich history of that. And in fact, the, my latest painting I just finished a couple of days ago uh, is uh, about the Mankato 38 plus two. There, it's not a figurative piece, but I've actually added feathers that, uh, you, know, you, you know, pieces that you can easily recognize, whereas my other abstract stuff is just really dividing the, the surface of the canvas. 